Hello everybody, Happy New Year to you from Tina here at Hummingbird Tales. Um, I've got a few videos that I'm going to be um, filming over the next day or so and uploading. Um, this one is actually a swap that I'm doing with a lovely lady called Gita. Um, but before I show you this, this is the inside of the box. I can't show you what she did on the um, front of the box because she wrote in this beautiful calligraphy actually my address and name and I've cut that off the box to keep because it's absolutely stunning um, but before I go on with this I just want to wish you all a really happy healthy and hopeful new year um, I'm truly believing that this is going to be a better year than last year and that we are going to end up um, in a much better place next Christmas than what we've all been this Christmas um, saying that I've had a wonderful Christmas um, just for my immediate family um, and uh, it's been really precious, actually, to have that time with my immediate family. I've eaten far too much um, Christmas pudding and cream. And so with the new year now ahead, it's back on healthy eating, the exercising regime and, of course, crafting. So the reason why I'm doing a swap with Gita is because um, Gita was one of the ladies that sent me a entry to my challenge giveaway when I did it back in um, the autumn and uh, she knew that I was getting some journal kits together which I will add they are coming together um, I've got to do a birthday present start Gita's um, swap and I will get them done as soon as possible um, and then put them up for sale but anyway so she was going to purchase one of those but then when we had a long chat um, Gita makes the most amazing oh, amazing dolls and uh, I, she sent me a picture of some of her dolls and I just fell in love. I'm not going to talk too much, but basically I asked if I could buy one off her and then she said, could we do a swap? So I'm going to make Gita a journal. Um, it's not going to be winter. I won't tell you anything about it until it's finished. But this is what she sent me and I received this. Oh my goodness me. What's today? Today is Saturday. So I think I received it earlier in the week. Well, it was earlier in the week. But I just haven't had the chance to come on here, do a video and to share it with you. But I am so excited. So this is the box and I just want to show you all of this. There's the most beautiful letter here and packages and all sorts. Now, she has said that I need to open the packages before reading the letter. And when I opened the box, this was on top. And just look at this writing, Fairy Express. She's um, put a fairy here because um, it was a fairy doll that I asked her to make me from Bolognese, Bolognese, I can't, Bolognese, I don't know how to pronounce it, <laughs> to Cornwall with love and it's just beautiful Gita and what I will say is Andrea Allen um, from Artie Mays gave me a calligraphy kit a few years ago now and I am going to get it out this year as one of my um, things to do. Anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take everything out of the box and um, stick it all down here. I mean, it's just, I don't know what she sent me. There's, there's more than a fairy in here. That says the doll. So, uh, oh my goodness me. I, I think she's over the top blessed me. Dear of her. Oh, this looks ominous. We've got some candles here. Right. So, I tell you what we're going to do. We're going to... As I open the box, I can't read that yet. So what I need to do is start opening the packages. Um, this is the doll that I've done the swap for. So we'll open her first. Right, so I'm just going to move these to the side here. And this is the doll. Oh, bless her. So she's got like a little sorry um, bow on here. Oh, I can't wait. I'm, I'm so excited to open it. Like I almost don't want to. Do you know what I mean? Um, I've got to be very careful. Oh, wow. And it's wrapped. Oh, my gosh, this tool is so soft. What a beautiful blue colour tool. Oh, thank you, Gita. And she's also wrapped in cotton wool. That is beautiful. Thank you. I can't wait to open this little lady. Oh, my goodness me. <laughs> I'll get there in a minute. I'm just being gentle because, oh, my God. Oh my gosh. 
Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. Oh, look at her. Now, this is the first snow for my friend Tina Ann Gita. That's 2020. Now, she has made this beautiful, beautiful doll. Oh, look, she's got sparkles in her hand. I'm just so overwhelmed. She's got snow in her hair. I wanted her to represent me. And when I straighten my hair, this is what it's like. Maybe not as beautifully um, styled as that. But the detail. Now, this is made. Well, I don't know what it's made out of. It feels like a clay, but it's very light. She's hand painted this. It is absolutely stunning. It's amazing. Oh, she's amazing, Gita. Oh, my gosh. She's more than what I thought she would be. And I just love her little petticoat. Look at these boots. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Thank you so much. She is absolutely beautiful. Something that I have not got from anywhere else. This is so unique, so different, and so beautiful. Wow. Wow. Absolutely wow. Thank you so much, kind lady. I absolutely love her. And I'm going to stick her there for a moment. And I'm going to keep the cotton wool around her because I really don't want her to break in any way. And I will be putting her on my shelf over here to the left, um, right beside me. It's my inspiration shelf. Um, I've still got things on here from last year. So I'll tell you what, I'll just pause, take this off and I'll show you. My inspiration shelf. And at the moment, I've got two shelves here. What I've got on here are gifts and diaries and things from last year that's been given to me or things that I've bought that are just, oh, sorry, really, really precious. And if you remember, um, this was made by um, Marion and given to me in my giveaway. And this journal here came from Jill. Um, these earrings came all the way from America from a lovely lady, and I'm sorry I've forgotten your name. This is a little tea bag book that uh, Karen O'Reilly made me. This is my little sleeping bunny that, that um, was given to me by a lady, oh, I think it was the beginning of last year. Um, that was from a giveaway I did, and she sent me that as a thank you. There's my little bunny bear from Joe. I've got some rabbits, bunnies up here, this one. <laughs> You hear that it makes a boing noise. This is the beautiful slow stitch journal that I received from that lovely lady um, who sent it in. Again, I'm sorry, I've forgotten all the names. And then this here is a little tiny weeny winter journal that Andrea gifted me um, probably a couple of years ago now. I've got the box to that up high on the shelf. Another fairy in behind here. I've got the journal that I purchased from Heidi McGregor. There's Bunny from Jenny Miller and his little journal. And then down here, I've got last year's birthday present from Karen, which was this amazing um, fairy journal. This is a little candle that I bought last year because it had the hair on it. There's a tiny thing of fairy cards. Um, this was a gift from Andrea Allen. And then Izzy sent me this beautiful journal in here. I'm sorry it's hidden a bit, Izzy. And then this was a gift from one of the ladies on my challenge. And of course, my little bunny that I swapped with Joe. And this bunny was from Karen O'Reilly. I got two teeny weeny bunnies here and a little candle that my daughter gave me, which says shine bright on it. Let's turn them around. Um, I don't, this little fairy is here just because I really like her and I wanted to give her some new wings because her wings have broken off, but I haven't managed to do that yet. And then here we've got this beautiful piece of art that was made for me. And in here I've got another journal from Andrea. And then this one in behind is an autumn journal that I was given by Janet Hicks. And um, as you can see, and these are my children when they were little. They're much more grown up than that now. And I must show you this. I think I can catch him. My mum-in-law gave me this huge um, bunny for Christmas. And he's behind a journal that Heidi's given me there and some bits and pieces. So I've got a big Peter Rabbit there. So anyway, I'm going to find, I'm going to redo this shelf because um, I'm going to put stuff up to inspire me just for now um, to get me through the winter. So I'll have winter, I'm going to make it winter sort of themed. 
and uh, this beautiful fairy or this little girl that um, doll that Gita has made me will be going up there back in a sec. Okay, so I'm back again. So let's have a look in this parcel. And again, she's wrapped it beautifully with this beautiful, um, I think she might have tea stained or coffee stained this. It's like um, a silky kind of um, ribbon. Isn't that beautiful? And I love brown paper. I'm always up for anything with brown paper. And what has she sent here? Oh, wow. Now, fantastic. This is beautiful, this aqua. And it's a burlap, and I haven't got any in this colour. That is stunning. Look at the load she sent me. Thank you so much, Gita. And, oh, look at this. Now, um, I'm going to be making, I will tell you this, I'm going to be making a journal, which is black and cream and white for Gita. I made one, a, a traveller's notebook version for Karen O'Reilly a while ago. Um, excuse me. I'm sorry that my voice is croaky. It's just the end of a bit of a cold. So, she sent me this and she sent me some black, um, oh, what's this stuff called? Creepy cloth. So I'm, I'm going to incorporate this into her journal. So that's brilliant. And bless her, some more of this tool. And I wish I could let you feel how really soft it is. It's beautiful. Oh, my day, she sent me a lovely neck curtain. Oh, no, I'm never going to be able to open all of this out. But look how pretty that is. With the scalloped edge and the flower design. Oh, it's just lovely. Oh, Gita, thank you so much, my love. That is so kind of you. Beautiful. And you know I will definitely be using these in your journal. And then we've got this. And this says a little extra, sorry, fairy dust. How cute is that? And this is just a scrappy bit of paper. And she's written on it beautifully and got some glitter on there and it's just so beautiful <laughs> so we've got this brown paper bag um, wrapped up with a lovely string it's really thin string actually and be very careful here I mean she wrapped this all amazingly well to come over from I think she's in Sweden um, I will check with you Vita because you know what I'm like I'm always forgetful Oh my gosh, what's this? Okay, so we've got a little box here. Let's open this first because, um, and this is, I love the way you've wrapped all of this. Just make sure my little doll's okay up there at the moment. I'm stood up doing this as well, so I am a bit clumsy at the moment. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! goodness oh my gosh he's made me a fairy house oh my goodness oh now I know she makes these but I never thought I would get one that is just absolutely amazing can you see I'm just going to lift this bit up. The detail on this. And this is all like a clay. And I think she's used... She might have used a little jar or something. But I have no idea what, how she's done it. But look how beautiful this is. Oh my gosh. The little mushroom head steps. Oh, and look at the top. Oh my gosh, Gita. That is just absolutely stunning. So, wow, I am speechless. Oh no, there's more. Oh my God, I don't mean oh no. I mean, oh my goodness me, Gita. What have you done? She's, look at this. So this is the little fairy that goes with her house. Oh my days. This is all a complete surprise because I was only expecting this lovely lady doll here. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to take her out of the box. Oh my gosh, she is just so cute. Wow, this is, Gita, this is just amazing. 
If I would had any idea what I was going to be opening, I wouldn't have been able to contain myself this long, I'll tell you. Oh. oh, my days. Look at her. Oh, she's amazing. Look at her hair. And she's got little feathers on her wings. And again, from Gita with love, thank you for all the inspiration. Oh, Gita. Oh my gosh. Absolutely stunning. How did you make all this so quick? Oh, it's amazing. Wow. Oh, and she wrapped it. Look at this. <laughs> I'm even excited about the wrapping because I know I can use that for a pocket or something. I've never seen anything like that before. Gita, from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. Oh my gosh, it's absolutely amazing. She is just adorable. Right, and there's one more package here, but now I know why she sent me the candles. Because obviously these can go inside the jar and light up. Oh wow, you're, you're painting. I mean, look at her work. Look at this little curl here. So delicate. Oh my gosh, it's just oh amazing. Right, I'll just move these back a bit because I'm very worried about them getting harmed. I'll stick you there. I'll leave the, the green here for a moment um, while I open up the last parcel. And then we've got a letter to get through. Now this says, uh, no, I've got another parcel here as well. Let, this one says. Some beautiful papers I found in a photo album. So, and this is, oh, I just love these little notes you've sent me. And look at these. This is all handmade paper. And it is beautiful. Gita, thank you so much. You truly are incredibly kind. And uh, we've got the last little parcel here. Oh, but this has been incredible. I just want to crack on with your journal and get it. Oh my gosh, what's this? Oh look, this is something a friend of mine was going to give to charity. I thought of you immediately because of the colour. Maybe you can cut it up and use it or pass it on to someone. Oh, it's a child's like kimono. But look at it, it's just... Oh my goodness me and there's little tiny trousers as well oh Gita this is amazing the patterns on this so kind of you to give it to me and I will share this because I'm going to be doing a giveaway um probably next month because I'm nearly at 3,000 subscribers and uh, I'm going to share some of the wonderful things that I've been given um, over this last year. And I will share some of this. I mean, just, I love these as well. Oh my gosh. Gita, thank you so, so much. Now I'm going to sit down and bring back my little fairy and the little fairy house, which I am just absolutely overwhelmed with and my other little doll so you can have a look at these while I just read the letter because um wow this was so worth waiting for and, and just look at this isn't this beautiful she's made this look so wintry and without any blue beautifully done beautiful to my friend Tina Ann and she's got a stamp here it's just amazing and just look at this. Look at that. How amazing is this? Now, <clears throat> I love this. November the 30th, 2020. No, it was December the 10th. <laughs> That's the sort of thing I would do. So, dearest Tina, I hope this finds you well and I hope you will enjoy what I've made for you. I certainly enjoyed this creative endeavour. I know you only wish for one doll, but while I was making the larger one and was ready to attach wings to her, well, 
it just didn't look right. So I made the little one and she looked adorable with her pair of wings. She certainly, she certainly does. The fairy house. You can use it for anything, a vase, a pen holder, etc. But I included a couple of tea lights to put inside. It looks absolutely gorgeous when the light flickers. Oh no, I'll be doing that, Gita, without a shadow of a doubt. Let me just put his lid there like that. Um, almost like someone is in there, maybe sitting by the fireplace. Oh gosh. Enjoy the fairy goodness, my friend. It's been a pleasure and a privilege to be able to give something back to you. You have inspired me so much. Take care, stay safe, and big hugs, Gita. Well, Gita, um, all I can say is you have just, oh, blessed me so much. This is amazing and all the extra gifts. And I just truly, truly thank you from the bottom of my heart. I am just completely flummoxed. Um, and I've got very little to say at the moment because I just, these are just absolutely adorable. And I, I love them. And you're so kind. And I will get on with your journal. So thank you so much, Gita. And guys, thank you so much for watching me and being with me while I open up this amazing gift. I am truly blessed. And I just want to wish you all again a very, very happy new year. And to you, Gita. And um, I hope that this year will bring you all peace and joy and hope. And a better end to the year than the one we've had. Bless you all. Goodbye for now. Bye.